Your pedals are one of the most important parts on your bike. It's the part that makes us one with our bikes. I recently got the Crank Brother Stamp 2 pedal and my review is coming up right after this. Navigating the maze of pedals that are available for mountain bikers today is quite the challenge. Most of all the component manufacturers and a lot of the bike manufacturers have a decent set of flat pet pedals. Once you've chosen a brand and a pedal, then you can usually continue to personalize with color. Also, if you enjoy my content, please hit that like and subscribe button. And make sure you hit the bell button as well, so that way you're notified of any new posting. Crank Brothers has five versions of the stamp, and each of them come in a large and a small size. The stamp one is a polymer pedal, and the stamp two, what I have, is a cast aluminum pedal. The stamp three kind of ups the ante and is a forged version of the stamp two. The stamp seven is a th lighter and thinner version of them all. And the stamp 11 is like the creme de la creme with a titanium spindle and premium bearings. Once you decide on which pedal is good for you, I chose the stamp 2. Now you must decide the size. I would say if you are foot size 9 or larger, go for the bigger size. I chose the large and I'm glad I did because they weren't as big as I thought they would be. If you ever purchased a Crank Brothers product, their packaging is very minimalistic and clean. One pedal is attached to the front so that you can clearly touch and feel the pins and, and the materials and see how the quality compares with other pedals. Once the box is open, there are a couple things in the box. The instructions, a Crank Brothers sticker, which we all love stickers, and of course, the other pedal. The other pedal is sealed in a reclosable bag. Not sure why this is, maybe one of you guys can mention in the comment if you know, but it does make the experience a bit be better. I do like the fact that on the right pedal they have the Crank Brothers logo, and then on the left they have a stamp. It's nice to, a little feature that shows that you have a pre premium feel and it's not just sent down the same assembly line. The pedals are quite a bit heavier than my old Chester knockoffs, but that doesn't surprise me considering I'm going from a polymer pedal to a cast aluminum pedal. Now here's a comparison of the stamp large next to my old pedals. As you can tell, they aren't that much larger. The instructions for the pedal are very nice considering it's just a pedal, but Crank Brothers has included the instructions on how to service the pedal. This is great because we can just keep it in our work area and reference them when we need rather than doing a Google search. Sometimes having a physical paper copy of instructions is easier than a digital copy when our hands are all grimy and dirty. The pedal is installed without any issues of course. Here are some of my final thoughts after my first real ride on the pedals. So what I think about the Crank Brothers Stamp 2 large pedals. I really enjoyed them, my first ride out on them. They were super grippy. So grippy that it actually tore my, well, actually pulled my shoe right off when I was trying to practice some manualing. Um, so I'll have to switch to my my specialized bike shoes instead of these ones. But anyway, yeah, they were, they were phenomenal. I can't say enough good things about them. The bearing was buttery smooth on them. There's really nothing bad I, I could really say about them except for maybe the price. But I mean, you kind of get what you pay for there. The quality's there. Um, now between the stamp two and then the next stamp up, I forget which number it is, the one that's milled instead of um, four, instead of cast, do I think that's worth it for a few extra grams? I'm sure if you're a racer it might be, but these ones are, I would say, perfectly fine for 90% of us. I do like the fact that you can service the pedal. That's a, that's a plus. And Crank Brothers actually provides you the instructions on how to service the pedal. 
which helps out bit tremendously. If you want to get some stamps yourself, check the link in the description. It takes you to Worldwide Psychory, helps me out, helps you out, we all win. So until next time guys, remember it's not about the lemons life gives you, it's about the lemonade that you make with it. Thank you. Bye.